Liverpool Parish Priest for St John's in Bethnal Green. Our next speaker is uh, Jackie Turner, who is a local GP, and Jackie is going to address, I think, one of the fundamental lies spread by the likes of the English Defence League that somehow our country would be better without people from different backgrounds. Jackie. Hello everybody, and it's absolutely fantastic to see so many people here and so many people representing our rich multicultural diverse community. I'm Jackie, I'm a local GP, I've lived and worked in Tower Hamlets for the last 25 years. My kids go to Swanley School in Whitechapel just down the road. And I can say to Tommy Robinson and the English Defence League, I do not recognise the picture you paint of the borough that I live and work in. I don't recognise your accusations that we're oppressed and we live under Sharia law. It's absolute nonsense. We have a rich, multicultural, diverse community which, which enriches us all and which we're all proud of. Tommy Robinson talks about democracy, but they behave violently. We know what they do. Why, when we come along our streets, if they're going to come here in peace, why do we need so many police here? We don't need them normally. Why do we need them today? It's because what they say that they represent democracy, they do not. They represent violence and thuggery. They would want to exclude, I work in the health service, they would want to exclude people from this country who hold the health service up. You go to the local hospital, you go to GP surgeries, you go anywhere. The people who are doing the hard graft are, by and large, people who come from abroad to hold our health service up. Our national health service would collapse if it wasn't for the nurses, the porters, the orderlies, the cleaners. Yeah. very, very little wages and have to work overtime and, and, and often have second jobs to make ends meet. They're the people that we should be celebrating and we should be fighting for. And I would say to the mainstream politicians, I would say to people like David Cameron, your rhetoric, your anti-immigrant rhetoric, your scapegoating makes it easier for people like the English Defence League to sow their filth and their hatred. Yeah. something else that's happened that they're proposing in the health service. They're proposing to charge people who come to this country who don't come from the EU. They're proposing to charge them to visit their GP. There's no way I am going to allow that. I'm not going to allow this government to charge people to come to see me. If people are, are ill, they require health care. And the NHS, like the rest of the welfare state, which this government are destroying willfully, needs to be defended. Our hospital down the road, fantastic new hospital. It's been built under a PFI scheme. I don't know if any of you understand, most of you understand what that means. But what it means is, in real terms, is over 100 million pounds every year goes out of our health budget in Tower Hamlets and East London into the hands of the private provider before anything is, goes, in, goes into, the, um, into the National Health Service to care for us. So that means staff cuts, that means um, that we don't get the care we deserve in East London. Well, Vodafone this week have already got off paying £12 billion as they've um, sold their subsidiary to Google. So we need to say to our mainstream politicians, no scapegoating, don't make it easier for the EZL to come here. We know that we stand together as a rich multicultural community and the problem is if Vodafone paid their tax, we have enough for all of the health service and all of the public services against which we struggle. Yeah. So I say, no to austerity, no to scapegoating, absolutely no to the EDL. We are the peaceful majority, and how dare they come here? They can come again and again and again, and we will stand in our large multicultural numbers and keep them out. We will always keep them out, no pass around. Thank you, Jackie.